but I'm going to show you how to download uh, WhatsApp chat histories. Uh, now, this is unlimited, so you can download as many messages using this method as you want. Um, the normal WhatsApp is limited to 40,000, but this is not limited. Um, so the first thing you need to go to is this link here, uh, which I will send you in the description. Um, and the next thing you need to do is to add, click on Add to Chrome here. Uh, and add extension. Uh, now, when you add it, first of all, uh, you well, you might not see it in here, or you won't see it in this section here. So you need to click on here, then you need to click on here, and you need to click pin, and that will add it here uh, to the um, to the menu here. Uh, now, the second thing you need to do is you need to go to WhatsApp here uh, for web. Uh, and then you need to sign in here. So just bear with me. I'm just going to sign in here for a second. You need to scan the barcode on your on your phone, and then that will log you in to WhatsApp here. Uh, so now we're logged in to WhatsApp. You need to click on the chat uh, that you want to download. So in this case, it's going to be this one here, and then we're going to click on the download here. So when you click on the download uh, icon here, you need to, well, it's best to click on CSV uh, because you can edit this in Excel or LibreOffice. So you need to choose uh, CSV chats here. Uh, and then all you do is you click on download here. Now, this might not work at first, as is, I found it's a bit, it's a bit of a bug. So you might need to, what you might need to do is reload this here. Just reload this. And you click on the chat you want to download again. Click here. Then let's just try it again. It should work this time. Yeah, so you, you, you need to reload, or you may need to reload the chat uh, twice. So you click on that, and then you can see here that it's uh, starting to download. Uh, it's starting to download the messages. So I'm going to leave that going. Probably there's a lot of messages here, um, so I'll we'll leave this going. In fact, what I'm going to do uh, is I might speed this up in the edit.
then at the bottom here, uh, you should see a CSV file. Um, at the moment, CSV file is the best uh, way to use this um, because the HTML one doesn't have the uh, names of the person in it. Uh, so that's it. All you need to do is just email that file there to me, uh, and then uh, that's that's pretty much it.